G'day guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're fishing Port Phillip Bay, targeting some squid, snapper and flathead. It's perfect conditions today, so we should be able to catch something. It's about six knots and 28 degrees today, so it should be perfect for fishing. It's nice and calm this morning, it's nice and cool as well, and then about 12 o'clock it'll start heating up, and by then we should be finished. So hopefully we can catch something. See you then. On the, the the new jig. Oh, just got inked. Oh, only a little squid there. Look at that, little one, but not bad. First squid of the day. Just caught that on the brand new Shimano jig, 3.0. And it's got a little mirror inside it to um, make it look like a bait fish. See, look at that. All right. So there's no size limit on squid. So we're going to take this one. We might eat it or we might use it for bait later for some snapper. So if you don't know, the way to put out squid humanely is to karate chop them just above the eyes here. Right? So you just want to hit it with your hand just there and right, just karate chop it on top of the eyes like that. Ready? See how it goes white? So now the body's dead, and now you gotta get the head. So you just hit it on top of the eyes there. And see now, the whole squid is dead. It's all gone white, so now it's all dead. So now we'll just chuck it in the bucket. We'll catch another one. Let's get back out there. Oh, a little flatty. Not bad. Oh, it fell off. Oh, uh, uh. Have a go at this day, though. Look at it. Beautiful today. Not much yet, though. Just one small squid and a small flatty as well. One that fell off. It was a disgrace. Unbelievable. But yeah, at least it's a nice day. Nice flatty, not bad. Gonna chuck mine out. Nice little flatty. Oh yeah, we've got another one. Mateo's on again. No one else has caught anything apart from me. I caught a squid before, but that's about it. Yeah, it's probably on a flatty or something. Oh yeah. Only a small flatty, you don't even need the net for that. All right. Only a small one. Come on. We need the bigger ones. Yeah, only a small little one there. That's alright. Probably undersized that one. We're in another little squeaker of a flatty. Tiny. Look at that. Absolutely tiny. Oh well. Let's go for the one-handed pass. Yeah. Bad. Nice little squid there. Not bad. Oh, and again, the, the rainbow jig with the mirror in it. Alright, so we'll karate chop him now. On the head there. And then down the head. Just like that, lights out. Alright, 
All right, let's go catch another one. It's coming, it's coming. It's coming. Yeah. Film this mark. Yeah. Yeah. Bring yours in. Go on, bring it. Ah, oh, he's on. Oh, yeah? Oh, you look okay. You look okay. Oh, there's another one. There's another one just over there behind. Yeah. Alright, well, oh, this one's not a bad time. Yeah. Not a bad one. Look at that, straight out. Alright, let's quickly get another one. <laughs> Quick. Alright, so I caught the flathead and the squid this morning, and now I'm gonna cook it up on the fire at the beach. So we just got a little campfire on the beach, and we're just gonna cook it up, fry it up in some olive oil, uh, flour, just all the basics and just hope it tastes good. All right, so we've just got the fire here and we've just got the beach over there. So, perfect. We're gonna, we're gonna cook it up on this. We're gonna wait for it just to burn down a bit, get some charcoal, and then we'll clean up the squid in the meantime, and then we'll cook it up on that. Now we have got the squid that we need to go and fill it. We've got a pan there. Then we've got our squid and flathead fillets from earlier. I'll leave the flatty fillets in there. And then we'll take the squid over. Go to the water. So now we're at the water and we'll clean this squid up. Here. We're gonna grab a knife and just slice it into nice squid tubes. Not too thick, not too thin. Okay, so now we got the flatty and stuff. Just gonna chuck it all in there. Just some plain flour. A good shake so that it's all full of flour and stuff. Got the old olive oil. So now we got the, the pan and the stick. Just gonna wanna flatten all this out. So I've flattened it all out. I'm gonna slap the pan on there. I'm just gonna open this oil up. I should have done that before, so probably do it before would be better. It's enough oil. We'll just wait for that to heat up a little bit. So now we'll just grab the flathead and the squid. And this oil is nice and hot now. Ow, that's a rock. Ow, that hurt. All right, anyway, grab that. Ooh, that's hot. That's good. We just get it all in there. Ah. Uh-oh, uh... uh. <laughs> Alright, so we're all good. No fire incident, definitely not happened. Alright, so, I forgot my tongs. We got an extra bit of squid so that can just go on the fire. We're just gonna want to cook that up and try not to die. Alright. That looks just about done. That was only like a minute cooking. So we'll just pull that off the coals. No! 
All right, so now we got the, the squid and the flathead. I'll just let it sit for a minute to cool down. Still quite hot though. We'll just put it all on this board here. All right, so I got a lemon as well, just for a bit of extra flavor. We'll catch that one. We'll cut that a little bit. So now we'll have some of this flooded. Thanks guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. A bit, a bit rushed while fishing, but that's all right. It happens. Anyway, so I'll eat some of the rest of this and catch you guys next time. See ya.